All right, so I'm sure Jamie was able to help you out there with your family. Well, I hope Jamie was able to help you out there. If you still got questions, at Jamie Eisenberg. It's Jamie with a Y, and he will help you out all throughout today, tomorrow, leading up to Sunday's games. You tell him Zaslow sent you. Don't worry, he will, he'll respond to you. He responds to everybody. You can always hit me up at Zaslow Show on Twitter. Love hearing from you guys at Zaslow J on Instagram. I'm an influencer on Instagram, but still... I love hearing from you guys, all right? I always love responding, so check that out. Hey, by the way, tonight, uh, going to Impact Wrestling. I'm going to, I've am going. i never been to Impact Wrestling. I'm hoping to see some of the guys we gave tickets away to. Thanks to Ross at Impact Wrestling for setting us up this week with, uh, with a handful of their stars. We had Brian Myers. We had Jay Vidal. We had Bully Ray, who was excellent. So if you missed any of that, you go back in the archives <coughs> of Zazlo Show 2.0. You can go on the YouTube.com slash at Zaslow show as well. Bully Ray was so... Bubba Ray Dudley. Bully Ray was so good yesterday. One of my fa- all-time favorite wrestling spots we've done. So if you missed any of those spots, you go back and check that out. I'd appreciate it. Make sure you like, rate, uh, comment, all that good stuff for the algorithm. You know, how, you know how that works. I don't know how that works, but you know how that works. And then I get all the monies. So there you have it. I'm excited to go to Impact tonight. That's going to be fun. They're doing a, a TV taping, Winter Warfare, tonight and tomorrow. Ticketmaster.com. If you're looking for your tickets, if you see me, say hello. I'd love that. So looking forward. My son and I, we are going to Impact Wrestling tonight. That's going to be really fun. Now, it is Friday. And I know you, you're probably saying to yourself, Zaslow, I got to know. Is it a big game or is it not a big game? Let's do it. Big game, not a big game. Every Friday, we've been doing it for years. Your entire life, Friday rolls around. And you're saying to yourself, Zaslow, I got to know. Well, now's the opportunity. You're going to know. All right. Big game, not a big game. (coughs) We start things off. Saturday, 2 p.m. Fox, England versus France. The World Cup gets going again today. That's right. We're in the quarterfinals. You may be listening right now, and you might already know what happened in one of the games. I don't know what happened. You're in the future listening right now. I'm right now. I got the game on my television screen right here. We got here. Look, I'll I'll actually let, let, let me give you a live update here. You got Croatia and Brazil going on right now. And I'm in the past. You're listening to this, but I got Croatia and Brazil nil nil they're in the first half you're listening right now maybe you already know who won this game you're in the future you know i don't know but tomorrow 2 p.m fox england versus france that's a big game right there i mean these two countries they hate each other i don't really know that so i'm I'm trying to hype it up but england france feels like a really big thing all right we got plans tomorrow to watch it before my son's soccer match. England versus France, that's a big game. Tomorrow, 4.30, Bally Sports Channel. Bally Sports Florida sucks, but it is what it is. Panthers at Lightning. Hate the Lightning. I believe this is the second matchup this year. The Lightning, of course, have gotten rid of the Panthers in the postseason the last two years. Very embarrassing fashion. Last year, Panthers looking for back-to-back wins. They, they've done it this year, not many times, but they have done it. Tampa Bay, they're ahead of the Panthers in the standings. The Panthers are still on the outside looking in as far as the playoff picture is concerned. But it was good to have Sasha Barkov back. Can the Panthers win back-to-back games? Can they get a win at the Lightning and maybe get this thing going? Panthers at Lightning, that's a big game. Moving on. Tomorrow, 5 p.m., Valley Sports Sun. That's the better of the two channels. Valley Sports Sun, San Antonio Spurs at your Miami Heat. The Spurs have lost 60 of their last 61 games. They, they don't win anymore, all right? They suck. They're, they're, they're tanking for Wembenyama. They're trying to get that number one pick. Spurs are really bad. The Heat, look, the Heat are not good. But the Heat are going to look for back-to-back wins. You got Bam playing probably the best basketball of his career. Who's going to be out due to resting tomorrow? I don't know. Your guess is as good as mine. We're going to talk to Raja Bell about that coming up in a few minutes here. Spurs at Heat, not a big game. It's not a big game. I can't do it. You got both teams are under 500. The Spurs are terrible. The Heat should take that ass. I mean, that should be a given. Not a big game. Moving on. Sunday, 1 p.m. CBS. New York Jets at Buffalo Bills. 
That's right. I hate these teams like poison. I wish both of them could lose. That can't happen. Both of them could tie, but both can't lose. That's not how it works. Jets, you're hoping that the Jets knock off the Bills here, so you got a chance to gain a game. All right. Bills, I hate their guts too. Do you want them to go into next week's game with a, a little bit of a winning streak here? Feeling good about themselves, those and the Dolphins? No, I don't think so. So we're all going to be rooting for the Jets, unfortunately. Jets at Bills Sunday. That's a big game. I got one more for you. I don't know if you know which direction I'm going in, but here it is. Sunday night, 8-20, NBC. Sunday night football, Miami Dolphins, your favorite little football team at the Los Angeles Chargers. This is the game of games. We're going to find out who the king of kings is. Tua Tonga Bailoa versus Justin Herbert. Everybody loves Tua. Everybody hates Herbert. And everybody's going to see Tua is by far the better quarterback of the two. Okay, first two years weren't bearing that out. But hey, the rest of their careers, so much more important. The Dolphins are going to take that ass this Sunday night. We're all going to revel in it. And Monday morning, you're going to tune into Zaslow Show 2.0. You can't wait to hear what I have to say about the big win and to his big performance. Dolphins at Chargers, that's a big game. And that right there is another edition of Big Game or Not a Big Game. Wow. Wow. What a show today. Let's take a look, by the way, at the AFC playoff picture before we get to Raja. Raja Bell is going to join us coming up in a few minutes here. Let's get to what the playoff picture looks like. Here we go. Uh... Buffalo, first place in the AFC. Everybody knows that. 9-3. and three. They have the Jets. Kansas City at 9-3. and three. They're technically second. They're at Denver. You got to figure out to win. Denver, so bad. Baltimore, 8-4. and four. They're at Pittsburgh. No Lamar Jackson. I mean, Baltimore could totally lose that game. So that's a game that we want to keep an eye on for sure. And Tennessee, 7-5. and five. They got Jacksonville. You got to figure they're going to win that game. <coughs> then you look at the wild card teams. Cincinnati and the Dolphins, both 8-4. and four. Cincinnati has Cleveland. I mean, Deshaun Watson's still going to be rusty. I don't see any reason to believe Cincinnati doesn't win this game. And then, of course, the Jets at 7-5 and five are at Buffalo. So, you're hoping, I mean, you're keeping your fingers crossed about Bills and Jets. But you're hoping that Baltimore can lose at Pittsburgh. Totally possible. So then, you know, if the Dolphins get back into a scenario where they're leading the division, you would be ahead of Baltimore. So that, that's another one that you're keeping an eye on. All right. 